Now to a story that will more than likely put a smile on your face. Six-year-old Ethan is getting his wish granted to be a garbage man for the day. Where did we pick you up? At school. Oh. <laughs> did you know we were coming to your school? No. <laughs> <laughs> so this is part of uh, his make a wish, you know. Ethan made a number of stops in Rancho Cordova and Sacramento on his route today. So the backstory here is that Ethan has cystic fibrosis. It's a debilitating disease that often leads to an early death. And CBS 13's Macy Jenkins with more now on his big adventure. Macy. Well, what a day it was. Ethan started the day meeting the mayor of Rancho Cordova and getting a key to the city. Along the way, he met firefighters, the police chief, and a bunch of other celebrities here in Sacramento. They were so excited to cheer him on lining the streets, and they just wanted to cheer him on even though they didn't know him. Who are you? A garbage man. It was the surprise of a lifetime for a six year old whose favorite thing is picking up the trash. You know, I want to be a garbage man when I grow up. His parents proud of their son for having such a noble dream. It's a respectable job, and if that's what he wants to do, we'll, we'll definitely support that. <laughs> This is really the epitome of what the world needs today. I mean, of all the things that he could have chose, he chose to actually be of service when he grows up. And that's what we need. Ethan's parents, Aaron and Ken, say Ethan has loved the garbage truck for years. It's been his passion through all of his medical struggles. Ethan was diagnosed with cystic fibrosis as a newborn. Did you know we were coming to your school? No. And the look on his face when the surprise was finally revealed, priceless. You ready to go for a ride of your life? All right. But some point later today, he'll he'll sort through all his goodies and things and realize that the city of Sacramento is in his corner. Sam. Let's hear it for Sam. His driver for the day, Sam Turman, who's never experienced anything like this in his 35 years on the job. Today is unbelievable. The day included stops at the Sacramento Bee and Fire Station Number Two. It's just so great seeing these wish kids when their wish finally comes true. And the grand finale was a green carpet event on the steps of the state capitol. He made a promise to Sacramento Police Chief Sam Summers. I will clean my room. I'll clean my room. I will eat my vegetables. I will eat my vegetables. And most important, I will take out the trash. More important, take out the trash. All right, excellent. What a great promise. Now, Ethan got to have a VIP lunch after everything was said and done, and the cake was shaped like a garbage truck. So, so cute. Coming up at 6, we'll take a look at what this means for the Make-A-Wish Foundation. So, Macy, last night, I think the garbage truck driver said that he was hoping he wouldn't cry today. <laughs> But oh, yeah. Did, do you know if he did? He didn't look like he cried, but he was definitely <laughs> grinning from ear to ear. I think I would have. So That's cute. That's a great story. It's the sweetest. All right, we'll see you at six. Good stuff, Macy. Thank mm -hmm. you.